Like when I'm on stage, like I'm a different person. Like I totally explode and I have attitude. And but when I come off the stage, I'm just so like this entertainment business has not affected me really at all. I'm still the same Britney. Britney Spears turns 33 today, and ET has been with her since the very beginning. Hey, you guys, I'm Katie Krause, and in honor of Brit Brit's birthday, here's a little trip down memory lane. Back in 1999, Britney had just hit it big with Baby One More Time, but she tells E.T. it was the Mickey Mouse Club that started it all. After that show, that's when I realized I had a major love for music. I had so much experience with acting and singing and dancing, and it was a, you know, a great experience for a lot of people, and it really motivated me to go forth and go for what I wanted. This is how you unpeel a crawfish. Take the tail off, the head's the best part. It's really good. Brittany recalled the moment she realized just how many former cast members had also made it big. I was at a Teen People party like six months ago. There was Carrie Russell there, and there was some people from NSYNC, and um, Christina Aguilera, she was there. And it was just so cool to see everyone. We're like, oh my goodness. Sit martinis, look hot in a bikini. You better watch your Today, Brittany is on top of the world. She spent Thanksgiving with her two sons and her new man, Charlie Ebersol, and the success of her Piece of Me residency in Las Vegas proves that she's still the ultimate performer. Here's to hoping that we'll have a new Brittany album next year. In honor of Brittany's birthday, though, let me know what your absolute favorite Brittany song is by sending me over a tweet, and of course, make sure that you include that ET Now hashtag.